Lewis Hamilton, Valtteri Bottas slammed for defending Brit, it was desperation Mercedes locked out the front row of the Hungarian Grand Prix and put on a magnificent team display as Hamilton led the race while Bottas kept a pair of Ferraris off the Brit's tail. However, four laps from the finish, Bottas' tires became severely wore and he was unable to stop Vettel rounding him on turn two. The Finnish driver attempted to defend the maneuver but collided with the Ferrari, who fortunately suffered no damage. A lap later, Bottas drove into the side of Daniel Ricciardo and was slapped with a 10-second penalty after seeing the stewards post-race. But he was lucky not to incur any further punishment for the earlier collision. It's fair to say Vettel arguably could have given Bottas more room on the inside as they headed to turn two, Palmer wrote in his column for the BBC. Vettel did close the door to take the apex and could have been more cautious, but Bottas never should have tried to recover the position in the manner he did. I think it was desperation from Bottas. He wasn't fussed about crashing with Vettel at that point and put his car in a position where a crash was almost inevitable. Vettel fortuitously stayed in the race to secure second place on the podium, ensuring Hamilton only extended his lead in the drivers' championship to 24 points. But had the outcome of the crash been different, Palmer feels Bottas could have found himself in further hot water. For F1's sake it was good Vettel managed to continue unscathed, because if he had retired after that hit from Bottas, he added. In the end, Vettel finished second and Bottas picked up damage, ultimately his comeuppance, and Vettel was magnanimous afterwards. If Vettel had retired, I think the inquisition from Ferrari and governing body the FIA would have been a deep one.